Um, so the next topic, domestic topic, big topic right now, uh, women's issues, okay? So I wanted to ask you guys about this. United States recently marked the 50th anniversary of Roe v. Wade, which was, of course, uh, it, this comes less than a year after it was repealed by the Supreme Court. So my question to you both, and we'll start with Doug, if you were a woman, what would you do right now about this situation? Well, many husbands today feel that if you're going to plan a family, you can't have this kind of ridiculousness that a woman or a 10-year-old girl or anybody else that way should be forced into something that isn't of their own between them and their doctor and their family to decide. Yeah. And, and uh, what, do you, what do you make of that? If you were a woman today in light of the Roe v. Wade uh, decision in the Supreme Court, what, what would you do? There should be parameters in everything in life. Yeah. Should a woman have a right to choose? Yeah, she can have a right to choose not to have <laughs> sex. She can have a right to choose have un she can have protected sex. Yeah. She has the right to choose having the baby aborted when it's a week old as compared to when it's 24 hours old. Yeah. Or 24 hours. <coughs> we give we give people too much power. Yeah. over every aspect, and it shouldn't be. Now, does that mean... Some water? <coughs> Dave, can we get him some water? <coughs> so we got... So, we got you. You got it? Right in, in this cup, yeah. <coughs> Take two. Wow, I think we're on a roll there. I told you to get water before, Doug. You didn't want to listen to me. You're warming up. <laughs> You're heating up. <coughs> you all right? Are you all right? <coughs> okay. Um, <coughs> Doug, do you want do you want a, a tissue? You all right? But where do you draw <coughs> the line? At what point? You can, you can just... You say that somebody can no longer make their own decision. I guess it depends on what your beliefs are. In the Bible, conception is living. So after you're conceived, you're actually murdering somebody. Now, that doesn't mean that if a girl is raped or incest or something like that, they should have abortion. There are all the circumstances. And, and, and you say that, but, but technically many, the, the Bible doesn't Adam, say that. Adam, in too many of them, they make no exceptions for this. Right. There is no exception for rape. Yeah. Or the, <coughs> the other contingencies. Yeah. How can you set a standard <coughs> where that kind of inhibition is just imposed on women? I mean, this is the problem. So that's like really. Oh, no, she can have the baby and give it up for adoption. No, that that you're asking somebody. What about that. girls that are having six abortions by the time they're twenty-five? Well, just keep paying for them. No, Let I the don't. Government keep paying, keep popping out, no, look, having I, sex. I, I don't condone that kind of libertine behavior at all. Right. But if I have uh -huh. to choose, it's like the old uh -huh. legal statement that if you protect the rights of one innocent person. Right. And nine others get off, whatever. It's better that the That's innocent man exactly. goes free. If a, if a car thief robs 30 cars, he goes to jail for X amount. Well, if I don't a girl keeps having abortions, yeah. they're habitual. Right, but, but understand. No, when I somebody know. does something over and over oh, and no, over again, absolutely no. they're I, hurting themselves but, or they're taking advantage of But why? I mean, there's, I mean, is it because <coughs> they don't like using condoms? No, or? it's because they know they can get away with it. They could go to somebody else and get somebody else. But you'd pay. rather use a condom than get an abortion, right? The Bible doesn't talk about in the instance of, the Bible doesn't say if it's incest or rape. No. That's where so it, that's an arbitrary. Had, yeah? But that's where the thinking part has to come in. You got all think. circumstances that cause pregnancies that are against the woman's choice. Yes, but right. you know that. And unfortunately, you have states and you have localities where that doesn't exist for these women, where it's an absolute ban. And what they're trying to do now is uh -huh. ban it on a national level. It's funny you just so. mentioned that because we do live in the United States of America. Yes. Yeah. Yet every state has their own rules. That's right. Yeah. So where is the you United? Don't even, you don't even have. Where's the United States? You don't, you don't even have. Um,